TPO Membrane Coated Scupper. TPO Membrane Coated Scuppers allow the flashing membrane to be welded directly to the scupper flange, eliminating any adhesives or primers. All scupper sleeves must have a continuous flange at the corners and must be constructed with soldered joints. Membrane coated scuppers are the only type of scupper allowed in a 30 year warranted system. Base attachment is required at all angle changes of 2 inches per foot or greater. This is done at a scupper by fastening the scupper flange to the roof deck and wall. There is no need to install fasteners or rusts at a scupper opening before the scupper sleeve is installed. Stop all base attachment approximately 6 inches from either side of the scupper opening. Install the scupper sleeve after the wall has been flashed. Cut a hole in the membrane for the scupper sleeve. Apply a bead of water cutoff around the throat on the back of the scupper. Slide the scupper into the opening and push it tight to the wall. Be sure there is no bridging at the angle change. Install fasteners in the flange to secure the scupper to the wall and to the deck. Use additional fasteners as required to prevent buckling. Keep the fasteners close to the outside edge of the flange. The area around the scupper should be clean and dry. Use weathered membrane cleaner to clean the membrane and scupper if required. Cut four pieces of six inch non-reinforced TPO flashing membrane, two for the sides and two for the top and bottom. Cut the pieces long enough to extend a minimum of three inches past the outside edges of the scupper flange. Round all corners. Reinforced membrane is not approved for scupper flashings. Weld the non-reinforced flashing membrane on the sides first by centering the six inch wide flashing over the outside edge of the scupper flange. The non-reinforced flashing must extend onto the membrane a minimum of three inches. Be sure to tuck the flashing tight to the angle change to prevent bridging. Weld the non-reinforced flashing membrane on the top and bottom flanges in the same manner. Center the six inch wide flashing over the outside edge of the scupper flange. Allow the flashings to cool and then probe. Repair all voids. Things to remember. All membrane coated scupper sleeves must have a continuous flange at the corners and must be constructed with soldered joints. Fasten each corner and space fasteners 12 inches on center on the flange. Only non-reinforced flashing membrane is approved for scupper flashing. Reinforced membrane is not approved for scupper flashings.